guys welcome back to my channel um, today I'm just preparing some beef short ribs I've never made these before so this is like the first time I'm trying it I probably should have tried them and then recorded it but hey it is what it is um, if you are new to my channel please consider subscribing I would definitely appreciate it um, and then like the video and comment and if you feel like sharing, also you can do that as well. So I just turned on my eye. Um, I'm gonna put a little bit of oil in the bottom of the skillet. Just so they can brown. Um, so once this heats up, then I will um, put the short ribs. I've already put some garlic powder, um, I don't know if you can see the seasoning, but I put some garlic powder, onion powder, and some black pepper on it. A lot of seasoning is gonna be inside the um, gravy that I make. So like, I didn't wanna like, you know, make it too salty or whatnot. So, yeah. So yeah, I'm about to put these in. I just want them to get brown. That's it, just to get them brown. Okay, one second. Um, hopefully everyone is enjoying their Sunday. This was my rest day. So I've been laying around the house. I'm about to try and wash a load of color clothes. Um, you know, to get ready for my work, my work week. So that's the plan. Um, I just wanted to rinse out my bowl that my, my meat was in. So when they brown, I can stick them in here so I can prepare my gravy. But yeah. So I'm going to let these brown for like a few minutes and then I will be right back. Okay, I'm back. Um, I just flipped them over. I'm going to show them to you uh, if you want to see. I just flipped them over. That one is on it kind of like, let me see if I can give you a better angle. Um, let me see. Let me see. Okay, I'm back, you guys. Um, I just flipped these over. I wanted you to be able to see, so um, I was just doing all sides before I take them out um, so they can be brown on all sides. Um, but yeah, so I'm about to take them out shortly, um, but I just wanted you to see what they look like, okay? Um, after this, I'm gonna put I'm gonna put them in a bowl so I can make my gravy, um, and I'll come back and show you that as well. Okay, be right back. Okay, I'm back. Um, now I'm about to put this Lipton recipe secrets in here. It's like some beefy um, onion soup mix. which is probably gonna darken it, up, darken it up a little bit more. I did actually add some, you know, some leftover, some old grease that has like, I guess, what I consider to be crumbs or, you know, the stuff that's at the bottom when you fry food. So I used that to darken it up. I usually will buy um, Kitchen Bouquet. It also, darkens up um, the gravy so 
um, this is what it's looking like so far. And then, sorry for the shaking or whatever, but for you to be able to see what I'm doing, I'm having to, um, hold my, hold on. Okay, guys, I'm back. Um, as you can see, it is pressurized because it's shaking. Um, I'm going to let it cook for like maybe another 15 minutes. And then I'm going to turn it off and hoping, fingers crossed, that the beef ribs are extremely tender. So, we'll find out in a minute. Uh, but I'm just going to let this ride for just a few. This is the very first time also me using this pressure cooker. Um, so, sometimes, you know, it can take me a little while you know to try to figure it out but everything it looks like it's doing pretty well um i'm just waiting for that to to get done and in the meantime i um i went ahead and started the water for my mac and cheese going to put a little bit of olive oil in it um, I'm not gonna cook an entire like a really big pan of mac and cheese just a small pan um, because it's only me and I don't need all that extra food, so I'm just gonna make a little one. Um, I'm not gonna make cornbread because I, I just I have a lot of carbs from mac and cheese to rice to gravy. Um, I might make some cornbread tomorrow, but today I'm just gonna make this so um, I can get ready to eat. I'm gonna put this on the Miss Candy J um, channel. And then I'm also going to do a mukbang, and that will be on um, Eat With Juicy. So, if you don't follow Eat With Juicy, um, definitely consider subscribing to that channel. Um, always remember, like, if it's something that you want me to try on that channel, um, just put it in the comments below on one of the videos. And I'll try to see if I can make that happen. Yep. Now I'm just um, I just put my mac and cheese in the oven. I will do a video on how I do that, but not today because this video is already long enough. But, um, But yeah. Oh, they fit. They. Oh my Jesus. Like if you want to see. Dang! It literally fell apart, you guys. Wow. It literally fell apart. Oh, 
hot. As y'all can see, it's still burning. But anyway, I'm going to plate it up. And then I'll let you see once I plate it up. But I just wanted to let you see it's done. Okay? I'll be back. Okay, guys. I'm back. So I'm just going to plate this. As you can see, um, they did actually fall apart. Let me try to get some. Okay. Okay, this is the end result of my dinner. Uh, I got some greens over there. And this is my food. So, if you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing, comment, leave me a like. And um, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye, guys.